Operon is a part of DNA which acts as a single regulated unit having one or more structural zin, an operator zin, promoter zin, regulator zin, a repressor and an inducer. Regulator zin is responsible for the synthesis of protein called repressor. These control the function of structural zin. Promoter zin is the DNA segment at which RNA polymerase binds. It initiates the transcription of structural zin. An operator zin is the segment of DNA which exercises control over the transcription. The operator zin works like on and off switches in protein synthesis. The regulator, promoter, and operator zin together called control zin. Structural zins are the segment of DNA which carry codes for the protein synthesis. For example, E. coli contains three structural zin, Z, Y, and A. Z code for the enzyme beta-galactosidase, Y code for the enzyme beta-galactose permease, and A code for enzyme beta-galactose transacetylase. The LAC operon is an example of inducible system in which the presence of an inducer molecule, in this case lactose, result in the expiration of structural zin in the operon. The structural zins are LAC Z, LAC Y and LAC A. Zins can be transcribed into mRNA and translated into protein. This system works in the following way. The LAC repressor protein encoded by LAC I zin is always expressed, whether lactose is present or not. In the absence of lactose, the LAC repressor binds to the LAC operator sites. Repressor bind into the operator physically block the progression of RNA polymerase. Since RNA polymerase is unable to transcribe the LAC structural zin, the corresponding proteins are not made. The environmental signal that turns on the LAC operon is lactose, but the actual inducer is allolactose. Once lactose enters the cells, the allolactose is present inside the cell, it binds to the LAC repressor, causing the repressor to change its shape. In this new conformation, the repressor can no longer bind to the LAC operator site. Without the repressor blocking its way, RNA polymerase is now able to transcribe the structural zin. Thus, in the presence of lactose, the LAC structural zin are expressed. The protein encoded by LAC Z and LAC Y zin participates in the metabolism of lactose.